It was the middle of the winter and uh, Mark came to visit. We ended up getting pretty cold temperatures and some really good snowfall. I just kind of showed him around Quebec the way that I like to, to ride it. We went to Le Relais, which is a little mountain. It's got two chairs on it and it's five minutes away from my house. I just kind of wanted to, to go show him that resort and at the same time it was a good way to warm up the legs and, and kind of just get back into it. We, we've always been saying, like, if it ever storms, let's go and ride downtown Quebec. I've, I, I've never gotten to, to actually do it. We are out here in the back country of Quebec. The streets aren't really plowed yet, so we're just gonna cruise around and hit whatever we see, and it should be good. My buddy Alex Kenton was free that week, so he just joined us for uh, our little Quebec tour. Over the kid's head. <laughs> Taking a little break from riding the streets, no car involved, no traffic. We're able to just come right in the backyard and walk from the house. And it's Mark's first time in the asthma, so it's going to be pretty fun. And normally we don't bring a camera either. <laughs> Smaller stands kind of work pretty well. Something like this. The... <laughs> My goal and I think everyone's goal is to just fill up the day as much as possible with like quality time like whether it's on the snowboard or at the resort or actually trying to ride some spots. We're just like having a lot of fun just like taking it really not seriously just but like in the end I feel like we got a lot of, a lot of fun stuff but some actual tricks.
this thing has seen like a lot of things. Some of the most difficult, most tech tricks done on a snowboard were done on probably that, that rail. It's cool that this thing was perfectly in line. You can just do a board slide now and it's okay. <laughs>